Okay, we here now. The Nigerian Army has placed Jackson Ude, a former aide to ex president, good luck, Jonathan, on its most wanted list. The question I, I, be, I was asking somebody that Soji Bello, the leader of uh, the bandits in the north, is there roaming about issuing statements here and there. They cannot even go and pick him, they know where he is. Uh, meanwhile, the governor of his state, um, I think it's Zamfara, has accused the former governor who happens to be the present uh, minister of uh, defense under this Tinubu's government. Now they are telling us that, uh, oh, you know what, all those allegations were untrue, uh, this and this and that, that is just politics and what have you, which, of course, a governor will be saying something. Before then, he has been accused of many, many things concerning this uh, banditry. They are, they, are trying, they are clearing him that uh, it, it, it you know, he's not done anything good and fine. Uh, not them, them. We have uh, all our other uh, bandits operating, you know, back to back. They have not declared any of them wanted. Before now, uh, Gumi, that, uh, that was always speaking in favor of a bandit, they never, they've never declared him wanted. That is why when you hear some people say that uh, this country is going nowhere, not be by swear, it's, it is the reality. The devil has nothing to do with it. It has nothing to do with uh, spirituality, but that is just the way it is. People are, are just bent on this country not moving forward. So, and that is how it's going to be until we are ready to do the right thing. Forget all this prayer that uh, people are just praying here and there. Yes, Inubu's wife saying that, uh, oh, Nigerians should pray for their leaders. Nobody should be cursing and all of those uh, BS. They will not see anything wrong. All the Fulani or the whatsoever they call them, Esme, that committed atrocities, you know, left, right, and center under Buhari. Nobody was arrested. Nobody. Nobody. That was how they went to. Some people tell you, don't tell us that they, they extradited the Nambekanu. Nambekanu was kidnapped from Kenya. And that is how it, it, it looks. So when they see you that you are always on their neck, there will be any small thing, treason. People will go on, on the streets to protest. It's, it's, it's treason. Everything is treason. Somebody said that, okay, it's like they don't even understand the definition of a uh, treason. Do you know that uh, it was the same Buhari that wanted to make us believe that a uh, revolution when uh, this man, Shawari, was always talking about a uh, revolution, revolution. In fact, uh, they made it a very big, even elite, even educated people started saying, why should Shawari use that word? You should have known the kind of a uh, country that you are in. And people are saying, even Buhari said, was saying, Revolution even made mention of worse things than even when what Warren said. Nobody went after him. He used the word revolution not until when this man showed us a look at dictionary meaning of revolution. Everybody, a lot of us ah, were like, ah, revolution. Showed shouldn't have used that word, though. Showed shouldn't have used that word, but see where he, 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 it has landed in. So that now the revolution is just, is just a normal thing until when they stood that. Revolution does not mean what they are talking about. So since that time, they are now coming back to tell you treason. And this uh, uh, word treason is always used among the military. If you went as a coup, somebody is declaring himself as a, a, not, a as a as a the leader of a country apart from the one that has been democratically elected. But if you go out of protest or if you say anything, it's treason. Uh, you cough, it's treason. You criticize, it's treason. You say you are hungry, you say. You, he said it's treason. Ha! Ah, now wow. Ude is accused of planning a mutiny, overthrowing, <laughs> overthrowing the democratically elected government and inciting anarchy. I don't understand. It was on when this uh, APC came on board, they started using all this rubbish. We even thought uh, Tinubu is even more enlightened than uh, Buhari because uh, you can you can pardon Buhari that uh, oh this man uh, was uh, a general before. So all those uh, terminology and all of that you'll be hearing in hearing all of those things under his government so what about it Buna? talking about it somebody want to overthrow overthrow how even when people protested about a uh end bad governance they said that they wanted to uh, uh they wanted to overthrow they will not be telling you democratically elected who elected them when they forced themselves on the people recently it sparked outrage with publications declaring the chief of army staff Lieutenant General Biodun Lagbaja dead and calling for a military coup in the country. Today's alleged crimes extend to sponsoring bandits, yeah, 
and Boko Haram creating unrest in the region. Let me take it again. Could this alleged crimes crimes extend to sponsoring? Okay, now. So it's not only calling for whatever or not ma only making a false allegations, also extend to sponsoring bandits and Boko Haram. Uh -huh. That one good as well. Creating unrest in the region and stealing gold from the Central Bank of Libya. Currently under investigation by the Libyan government. Ude, Ole, Ude. <laughs> the army said declaration highlights Ude's actions as a significant threat to national security, fueling security, and betraying the trust of millions of Nigerians striving for peace. Reno Mokri, that has, is now part of Tinubu's this in everything he says, everything Tinubu does is always good. Is the one, even as, okay, that one is even far. What about a uh, what was this guy's name? Asai Dokubo that was calling at a uh, Igbo uh, Igbo race. That one is not anarchy. He said he's, he was going to buy, he was going to do this. No, they did not, they will not see all of those things. Despite being based in the US, that is today, Ude continues to make unfounded claims against the government and its officials on Twitter. Reports suggest today is being bankrolled by a governor from the northwest, collaborating with a retired former generous because i understand that uh, ude is from the southeast uh i think uh, i believe he's from the uh, Igbo extraction so now he does not have any affiliation so to the north that's why they are saying this uh, what is it called um a a a, a, a what a, a governor okay maybe before you know it say he might be governor of samfara because that one has been against uh, matawali this alleged backing Raises concerns about the extent of Ude's influence and potential danger. Meanwhile, this guy they call a uh, this bandit uh, campaign, they have not been able to fish out where he is. They have not been able to fish out where he is, and he's in Nigeria. But they are telling us somebody who is a uh, far away, is, uh, uh, America is the one who is uh, doing all manner of things. The gold that they are. The, they, are, they are mining in uh, Zamfara. They are stealing here and there. Our police, our army, they have not been able to to get a hold of those people. Meanwhile, Asari Dokubo is uh, accusing them left, right, and center. He's using them to do yeah, yeah. They cannot go and fish him out. So they cannot even say, even when I heard the response of uh, the Nigeria army, when they responded to the allegations by Asari Dokubo that they are the ones stealing oil. I was so ashamed of myself. I was ashamed of them, not even myself. Ashamed of them. Can you imagine? Somebody was accusing you, or is still accusing you, of this uh, weighty allegation. You just, uh, you just responded like a baby. They just collected sweets from a, you know, when toddlers are fighting for sweets, he collected it. Hey, get away! I don't want to fight you. In fact, it was so, 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 so childish. FT or you know, weighty allegations like that, they could not even answer him respond to him strongly now they are talking about uh, they trying to cause a uh, chaos the nigeria army's declaration underscores the severity of Ude's alleged offenses and the need for swift action to prevent further instability in the region hmm. <laughs> nigeria army with treason case and wiki is busy wiki is busy committing treasonable felony in reverse and nobody is charging him for it it is like the man is involved from cause of things in this our country yes so it is today the problems that we are faced with even the the way they have battered the economy is that not reasonable because the responsibility of a, a government is to protect lives and property make sure that the people's welfare is well taken care of but what do we have now somebody was even telling that a lot of people just they buy because of hunger Food where they want it, you know, day hmm. God will not help you. Say, make you know, maybe you can't go sick. Join you don't finish with us. These fools called army of Tinumbu had started embarrassing themselves again. They will never stop fooling themselves before the international community. After releasing Boko Haram bandits who have been killing people now, person like we they will now won't use shine when with this administration's face front, people are in pain and crying in hunger, they are busy chasing shadows the only thing that matters to this uh, current uh, government is to retain power let us see how long they will tussle it with god army go catch boko haram leave Percy with treason boko 
they wait for now for bush leave innocent and suffocated nigerians breath let them beat let them beat our market i go to meet nigeria army as one entity with the ability to start to stay clear from corruption is that a is the man not a don't pie before rubbish god we judge nigeria military for lying against an innocent say, civilian citizen <laughs> nigerians are much wiser now in the court of our public opinion this publication lacks merit and credence people now read in between the lines and decipher truth from far objective assessments are made on every mail and comments followed that's it so guys uh, let's say your opinion and have your take on this thank you